All right, welcome back, y'all. Uh, it's been a while since we put a video out. We have been busy as all get out this summer. We've been doing a lot of traveling, uh, a lot of fishing, uh, a bunch of other stuff, getting ready for our big move back out west. Uh, we came in off of a good fishing trip last weekend. So what we're gonna do is do a little bit of time. I figured I might as well do some recording, put a couple videos up while we got a little bit of time. What we're gonna tie today, this is uh, a bug made popular by Alvin Dito. It's called the Dito Popper. There is nothing to it. If you fast forward to the end of the video, it's probably only gonna be maybe four minutes. We'll see, it depends on how slow I talk. Um, super easy fly. I tie this all the way from an eight all the way up to a one aught. What we have in device today, this is a Gamakatsu size two, it's a BTNS, it's a stinger hook. Uh, the body material is gonna be made out of foam. The major part is gonna be, this is uh, three quarters of an inch. As you can see, if you hold it up to the hook eye, it stops just short of the point. That's how I usually use to measure uh, what size my main body is gonna be. And the cap for that, I usually hold it off an extra quarter inch or kind of split it in half. Uh, this one is a quarter inch since it's a bigger hook. So this actually is a half inch piece of two millimeter and for the tail of the fire or the fly we got chartreuse rabbit zonker strip and for the thread thread really don't matter you're gonna cover it all up we this is uh, 140 in olive and you're gonna add two doll eyes these are the cheap doll eyes that you can get from just about anywhere uh, you don't have to add those they just add a little extra noise to the fly so what we're gonna come in we're gonna come in and get started Catch our thread in, work it back to just about the hook point. We're gonna come in, clean that out. Tail is gonna be uh, the body, or the tail. It's gonna be about a shank, maybe a shank and a quarter in length. I guess if it's too long and they start short striking on you, you can always shorten it up on the water. Uh, what I like to do, I like to come in and get a little bit of this down to the bare hide makes it a little easier tie-in point I'll catch that in right on the top hold that all in make sure that's good and secure there is nothing to this fly uh, this is one of the flies I've been fishing a lot this summer that's why we're going to go ahead and do a video because I got to spin up quite a few of them uh, today and tomorrow we have been wearing small mouth out on this. In a really good pattern. That's all the time we're gonna do. The rest of this is gonna be done with two millimeter foam and super glue. We'll come in, cut that down to uh, roughly an inch in length. That way when you fold it over, it's only a half inch tall. We're gonna super glue this in over itself just like that. And that, that puts us almost all the way to the end of the video. Um, don't glue your fingers together, of course. Um, okay. Hopefully everybody's doing good. Uh, hopefully everybody's got to do a little fishing since they eased up on the restrictions. You're probably gonna hear the man mowing the yard in the background. I don't know if you can hear that or not. Hopefully not. He, he took a break. I figured I'd squeeze this in real quick. Now for, you can you can round this over. You can make this taller. You can do whatever you want. Uh, normally what I do, I come in, I get an idea about where I'm gonna put my top piece. I come in with my curved scissors and I just cut that out. You don't have to do that. I just, I do it anyway. Uh, same with our half inch piece. We're gonna cut that down to about an inch. That way when it folds over the top, it'll be good. Like I said in the beginning of this video, there is nothing to this video or to this fly. But for it to be so um, few materials and so simplistic, it takes fish very well. We're gonna come in with our doll eyes. And we're gonna glue those on the sides. Now these are only on there 
I guess you could you could draw them on with a marker if you wanted to or maybe if you're just looking for that aesthetics or whatever but the reason that these eyes are on here is these doll eyes when you shake them they're like mini rattles so it adds a little something to it I've tied this fly uh, you can tie it with weed guard I've tied it with legs and all kinds of stuff and what I found is I'm always going back and pulling the legs off uh, the legs just skip it tight just like Alvin does uh, he calls this his number one god fly because it's simple it's cheap and it takes fish um, that's all there is to Dito's popper um, one thing I would recommend that I noticed while I've been fishing this over the last week is you might want to add a swivel to your line uh, it does put a lot of line twist in uh, in your leader so you might want to put a swivel in there up to you However you want to do it, like I said, you can tie it in several different sizes. Uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. We're going to try to put a few more out while we're home this week. Uh, go ahead and like, share, and subscribe. Show this to your friends. And follow us on Facebook and Instagram. And until next time, you guys keep tying.